This is a mystery painting series that will slowly reveal the mystery painting from Diamond Art Club done by Abraham Hunter. <laughs> Not Abraham Lincoln, Abraham Hunter called Secret Garden. So if you have this painting or are trying to obtain this painting to do for yourself, please click out of this video as it will slowly reveal the painting. Hello, shiny, happy people. Uh, my name's Kim and welcome to Kimba's Crafts. If you're new here, then welcome. And if you're returning, uh, welcome back. Thank you guys so much for coming back. So this is going to be um, part or episode two, I guess, of my mystery painting. And basically, uh, it's going to be the first episode where I do a square. So the first, if you guys aren't aware, I am doing a mystery painting. Uh, I know that you saw in the beginning that this is going to be a reveal. So if you, you know, if you plan on doing this painting or trying to obtain this painting, um, again, please click out because I am going to be doing spoilers as I, um, do square by square of this painting. So there is a, a preparation of the canvas and how I'm planning to do the, the mystery painting. And there's a video for that. This is going to be in a playlist called Mystery One because I, I if, if this is fun and works out the way I feel like it's gonna work out, I'll be doing it again because I have another mystery canvas. So every week I'm going to reveal one square and we're gonna do that with this color wheel. So, I wish I didn't do that. So let's see which, which one we're going to do tonight. Yay, number 28. Okay, so where is that on my canvas? All right, that's kind of a fairly um, small one. It's all the way here on the side. So that is going to be the square that I diamond paint tonight. All right. So, so I'm going to just line this up better. I think this one is okay. Okay. All right, let's have some fun. Um, let me get my drills. So I, I did spend one day kitting this up. You guys, I told you I was gonna be using this and I had to use one whole side because there's, I think, 66 colors, 66 colors. And then half of or however many a third of another side and um this is all the leftovers look at these colors though so much fun and here's all the leftovers I couldn't fit in the bags I just keep them storing there all right, let me see. So I'm just gonna move the canvas over.
one second. Okay, guys. So I'm actually going to cut this into half a square and then do half and half because it's just that's too big for me to look at. And this looks like it's going to be a little harder than I'm used to. So. Like so. Okay. All right, let's see here. All right, so I have the new trays, and um, I've been using them. I use them for the the Diamond Painting Deutschland, which I single placed. And then I've been using them on the Beauty and the Bear, which I was multi-placing with. And I will say that this is my favorite one. I just love this size. I love this size uh, of all the trays. Um, I, I, I tend to go for this size. And the square one is kind of awkward. It's awkward because you have to, so with this one, you the, the grid is going this way. It's going this way. So you just shake it down towards the funnel and it makes it very easy. But with this one, because the grid is going, it, the funnel is not right at the bottom of the grid, you have to shake them down this way and then funnel them out. That's why there's, so it's just a little awkward. Um, I, it, you know, and there's a little learning curve with, I think all, every time you get a new tray, um, like at first some of them were popping out and I was like, oh, do I need lids? Um, but then I got used to it and, and it was fine. This one is just easier to use. They're, they're standard tray. This one is just a little more awkward. And then the big one is just like this one, it's just bigger. This one is just easier to handle, I think. As far as like sticking points, um, I used this one the most and there were a couple, but it wasn't bad. It didn't bother me. The funnel is great, that works perfectly. I like the cover over it so that you can be kind of aggressive with, push, with um, getting the drills out. So I really do like these trays. I would get more of this one. Two of these is enough, uh, you know, just to switch it up and have something different. But um, yeah, and then on, on the corner ones, there's, I don't know if you can see that. See that? Sometimes they, like they get stuck or whatever. So it's just a little harder to finagle with this one. This one is much easier. It's just like a regular tray with, with the great funnel. These are very easy to get in and out. They, they're all interchangeable. They're all the same size. Um, I believe they even sell like a four pack of these in case you lose them or something like that. So that's awesome. So yeah, we'll see how I do with the squares because the Beauty and the Beast is uh or the beauty and the bear they're rounds so we'll see how these trays work with squares and i'll multi-place if i can in this so um this looks like it's probably a little heavy uh confetti heavy confetti means there's a lot of color changes in one area and you can see there's a lot of different symbols in that area so I'm just going to, what I normally do is as I get to know the colors, well, I usually try to do the letter or the number that has the most. So right now I'm feeling like it's the zero. I could be wrong, but that's what I'm seeing a lot of. So we're gonna go with that, which is a purple. All right. This is exciting. What am I making? 
I don't know. Let's find out. Okay. Now I'm not used to uh, multi-placing squares. And I usually get down really close, but like I don't want to be getting my head in it. And I can't tell if I am. I always use a light pad, even if it's light or dark, but I think with this one, I can use it on a lower setting. Okay, I had to move you guys because I, I, I have to lean over. I have to be able to see better what I'm, what I'm doing. I do a lot of straightening. <laughs> Fade away, yeah, 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 yeah. 
yeah, I'm about to fade away. Cause every time I wake up, I feel like it's Monday. Something's going wrong with all the chemicals up in my brain. All of a sudden, I don't look at anything the same way. Got a build up of my thoughts sitting in an ashtray. I'm sorry that I'm so inconvenient, okay? Just let me be me and I'll stay out of your way. I can see the way you look at me, I'm such a disgrace. I never really asked to be brought into this place. You wanna love me? Well, then, baby, I have a taste. All the highs and the lows, no, you'll never be the same. I don't really wanna hurt you, but I can't control the pain. If you're sticking by my side, maybe we could be okay. Okay, okay, maybe you could be the change I need today. I promise that I've never felt this way. I really hope that you will choose to stay through all the pain. I know you told your friend you're not okay. And tell me what's wrong and why you never said you felt that way. Cause you're trying to stay strong and fake a smile until I look away. But I've known you too long, it hurts to watch your blue eyes fade to gray. As you fade away, yeah, 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 yeah. as you fade away.
Okay, guys. Whew. So that took a long time. Ah, uh, yes. Whoops. Okay, guys. All done. First square is done. Look at all the color. That was a lot of confetti. Oh, one of them's popping up. Hold on. There. I just didn't push it down right. Um, God, I don't know how many colors I used in that, but it took... Two hours and 21 minutes to do this. Two hours and 21 minutes for square 28. That's a lot. So that is this week's square. And I'm going to, hold on. Okay, I'm just pulling you up. So it looks like so far, like a purple bush. So pretty. All right, and it looks like maybe there's a red group of red flowers or bushes um, over here. I don't know if that's water, but first square done. Yes. All right, see you guys next week for square number two. Well, I don't know what number, but you know, the second square to be finished. What number? Who knows? Round and round the wheel will go. I'm so dorky. Okay, I'm tired. It is almost one o'clock in the morning. And um, yeah, if you like this video, if you wouldn't mind giving me a thumbs up on the way out. And if you want to follow along with this project, the mystery painting reveal week by week, um, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and ring the bell. And then you will know when I upload all my videos. I also have another project happening right now. It's under the playlist Deutschland, and that's my diamond painting Deutschland. It is the Unicorn Kiss by Josephine Wall, and I am uploading weekly videos for that as well. So if you want to see more, go ahead and hit it. Hit the subscribe, hit the bell, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care and keep diamond painting.